Hello friends, our today's topic is about IP addressing configuration. This is the totally practical topic. So today I am going to let you know about like how to configure router and how to provide IP address with subnetting on our design. Okay, so let me start with the design. So I am going to use this router 1, 2, 3 router. And I'm going to use three switch 2960 is there. Th these router and switch we have already discussed in our last lecture, like what is router, what is switch. So in end device, we can get one, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, you can choose one more IP if, if you need. Then like it's about you that you are going to choose uh, how many PC in your network. Okay. So I told you about in last Cisco packet tracer video like that if you are going to connect PC with switch then you are going to use with straight cable fast ethernet fast ethernet fast ethernet so I am going to use this command sorry this is cable connectivity after that I have to put command here so from switch you can choose any fast ethernet interface it's up to you so our lan network three lan networks are completed now router to switch i am going to choose again fast ethernet okay but i told you that if you are going to connect with router to router then you can choose cross cable okay but for example you are not going to choose fast ethernet cable here then you can choose off the router you can choose here hwic 2t port here and on the router okay so with this what you can do, you can add an WAN interface card in your router. After this, you are able to connect your router with serial cable. Here is serial cable. So connect serial 000, 000, 000, 001, 000. Okay, so no worry about like 001 is going to connect with 001 only. You can connect it with 000 only. Okay, so now here, I need to provide IP address okay first uh, I want to explain for example this is my first network okay second network and third network so in these network we have one two three and four total four IP I need here I also need only four IP address okay so in last subnetting video in in that video we have discussed about like if we need two valid ip then i'm going to choose slash 30 six valid ip slash 29 14 valid ip slash 28 so here i need only four four ip so i am able to choose slash 29 here okay four ip i'm erasing this and i'm writing here slash 29 because with the help of subnetting we have to configure this and here we have a network where we need only two ip address so i can choose slash 30 here slash 30 because we need only two ip address and now uh, in flsm we have to use about like a class ip b class ip c class ip but with the help of VLSM, you, you can choose any IP address here. Okay, for example, uh, here you want to use another network, here another or another. For example, here you want to choose like, I'm just taking an example. Here you want to use A class. Then you can choose this. Here you want to use B class. Then you can choose slash 29. Here you can choose class okay so within van link you can choose any IP address like here uh, 20 000 slash 30 and 30 000 slash 30 
so the meaning of these ip address is like here i can put ip address 1 2 3 and f0 by 0 is 10004 here i can give 172160.4 here i can give 192168 1.4 and the ip address assigned to fast ethernet port is known as the default gateway for lan so let me start with practical right now okay so i i uh, i hope that you understand the concept so first of all i am going to configure my okay let me let me erase this 10001 255255255248 because slash 29 i'm using and gateway is 10004 so i'm just copy the gateway because i have to choose in another network also 10002 and subnet mask i have to change manually 10001 255255255248 and 10004 is the gateway okay so i will write i can write in sticky notes also 10004 here i want to use 172.16.0.4 and i am using 192168.1.4 the ip address here is 2001 but slash 30 Twenty zero zero two, thirty zero zero one, and thirty zero zero two. Okay, so uh, in this also I have to choose twenty zero zero one, two five five, two five five, two five five, two forty eight, twenty zero zero four. So I am going to copy this subnet mask because I have to type again and again. 20002 so paste the subnet mask 2004 this is easy 2003 okay 2004 so here oh sorry my mistake here i have to choose 172.16 0.1 because i am choosing wan for 20 ip address so not an issue we can change just within one minute one here i am using 2 and 4 3 and Four. Okay. So here I have to choose IP address with 192.248 and 192.168.1.4. So if you are going to start with first time, then sometimes you will face some problems, but it is very easy coding. You don't have to worry about it. Okay, so the last IP address is done. So my PC's IP addresses are configured. Now I have to configure router. The important part. Okay, so in our last video we have discussed about CLI command. We know that we have to put no here. First command is enable, and after that I am going to choose config terminal command. so now how to provide ip address to router so we have two ports of router fast ethernet and serial so i'm going to give interface fast ethernet 0 by 0 ip address 10004 so this is the gateway for lan 1 and the subnet mask should be 248 okay Uh, actually i have put tab so that's why you are seeing three commands so by default the link of router is down 
so you have to use command here no shutdown when you will use command no shutdown the link will be up if it is connected to switch if it is connected to router again router then you have to no shut command uh, put no shut command on another router also so exit interface serial 0 0 slash 0 slash 0 IP address 20.0.0.1 and here I have to use 252 because slash 30 I am using no shutdown exit okay so I told you about one thing that if you want to see running configuration then you have to use that command in enable mode show run that you can easily see this IP address is configured with this this is configured with this okay I will uh, going to configure second and third router before but before that I am going to introduce one more command for example you are checking show run command in config mode ok show run then it will provide you error invalid so the concept is if you are going to use enable mode command in config mode then you can put do keyword before that like if you are using show run in enable mode it is right but if you are going to use show run in configuration mode then you have to put do keyword before command this one like do show history do show IP interface brief so this is the basic command now move on to router 2 so on router 2 I have three interface okay I am using short forms enable and config okay so I have three interface fast ethernet serial and serial 001 so it's up to you that you are going to configure it very first which interface 172.16.0.4 and and then no shutdown easy and after that exit this interface go for interface serial 000 IP address now this port IP is 20.0.0.1 so definitely this should be 20.0.0.2 255 no shutdown so this link should be up that's it ok you want to see the history in between configuration then you can put command do show history like if you want to see this but our one more interface is left interface serial 0 slash 0 slash 1 IP address this one 30001 no shut so this one ok if you want to save the configuration then I told you that you can use command write but if you are going to use in this configuration mode then you can put do write building configuration ok in first router I am going to change do write now this configuration is saved ok now move on to third router third router is also same as enable configure terminal interface fast ethernet 0 by 0 IP address 192.168 sorry 195 uh, I wrote 195 instead of 192 1.4 255-255-255-248 so again no shutdown the link is up and after that interface serial 0 slash 0 slash 0 IP address 30.0.0.2 and no shutdown so if you want to save this do right ok so this is done with my IP addressing with subnetting ok now you want to check basic command here like ok sometime one more thing 
sometimes this error will be there translating domain server then you have to choose control shift 6 okay you have to choose control shift 6 in this and after using this name lookup will be aborted so show IP interface brief it will show you which interface is assigned with which IP address okay show IP root so show IP root will provide you the routing information like 10 and 20 are the direct network of this route okay so this was the configuration of IP addressing thank you